All right, guys. Welcome to Full Moon Hot Rods. It's been a little while since I made a video. Uh, I, I have worked on the car a little bit, not a whole lot. Uh, but life just gets in the way, and I'm not no full-time YouTuber, so I do what I can do when I can. But uh, anyway, I have been working on the Model A a little bit, and I put the top wood kit in. I have got that in now. Uh, and I've got the wood back around the quarter windows and um, the piece that goes around the back glass, my top part's good. The two pieces that goes beside the back glass and under the back glass are bad. And I didn't realize it, so I didn't order it. But um, with the top piece being good, I've got some oak wood and stuff. So I'm actually going to make the, the bottom piece for the uh, back window, the lower bottom and the two sides, they're pretty straightforward. Uh, it's not gonna be too hard to make. So <clears throat> I'm not a woodworker, but still I believe I can pull that off pretty good. But um, anyway, I'll show you that in another video uh, when I get it in. I was gonna try to film this or video it, uh, putting the wood in. And I didn't have nobody at the time to help me when I finally got to work on it far as to run the camera or whatever. So anyway, I put the camera in the car with me in the car and trying to do the wood on both sides. I just couldn't get it where it would look good. So I said, I was just gonna go ahead and put it in and I'd bring it back and show y'all what I done. And I hope y'all understand, but I mean, it, it's hard by yourself to video inside of a little thing like that as big as I am and try to get the camera in the right positions. Most of the time you couldn't see what I was doing because I was my body was in the way. But anyway, I'll bring you over here and show you what I've been messing with anyway. But um, you can see there where I put the new header piece in, put all the top bows, put these pieces here in. I don't know what you call them, but I put that in. And if you come around, Down here and get in the car and take a look up you can see what I've got in now um, this piece of wood here is still good there's nothing wrong with it so I'm not replacing it the pieces around the window around these quarter windows was good I mean it's just as solid uh, so I'm not gonna replace no more than I have to replace on it but y'all can let me know what you think I think the wood kit turned out pretty good though, as far as this top wood. I had never used that company before, but um, it fit fit pretty daggone good. But But now my, my top model's back in shape and everything. And the piece that goes right here, I've got it over here. Here it is. This is a new a new reproduction one. I got the original one, but it's it's got holes in it rusted in the bottom right here. And instead of fixing it, I decided to just go ahead and go with this this piece here. So I got to I got to put it on. <clears throat> but there's not much to it. It just pretty much nails on. But anyway, it goes on something like that. And then around where my finger, my index finger is pointing, you, you, you nail it across the front. And then it has some screws up under the bottom that the windshield frame holds it on where the hinge goes. But, um, Anyway, that's where we're at with the car right now. So I'm gonna try to get this back glass piece made and I'm, I've got the, some oak wood and stuff right here. I know that's some more pieces that was out of the car. And that's the old wood out of the car here and here. But I bought this song, um, I bought this oak wood here. So what I'm gonna do is glue glue all it together 
And the piece I got to make is this piece right here. So I got all my shape to go by, so it's not going to be too bad. Pretty straightforward. And then I have two grooves in it here. And then it has two small pieces of wood. Here you go. This goes around the top of the window here, and this goes in around the sides. But this is the piece that comes by the sides of the window, and they're bad. So I got to make these two pieces here and here, and then make this bottom piece. And like I say, that's pretty straightforward. It's got a little curve in it, but once I glue it all together, I can cut it out on the bandsaw, and it won't be too bad. But anyway, uh, guys, I was wanting to give y'all an update on it. But like I say, I have tinkered with the car a little bit. Uh, haven't been able to work on it like I should, but anyway, we're getting real, real close. If I can get this wood back in it, and I need to make the top insert, because I'm not gonna put the batten and the, the chicken wire and all that stuff in it. I want to actually put a metal top in it, but I do want the metal top insert in it, but I want to leave my groove around the edge for my uh, item tack strip to go around, and then I'll put my material right on top of the metal roof or whatever. But um, but I want it to look original, but I don't want to. I don't want the top flapping or swelling up when you roll the windows down and all that kind of stuff. But I think it's going to turn out look pretty pretty decent. But I can't wait to 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 start uh, getting the body ready to paint in the chassis. But I say that, but that is a lot of work. Oh, the other thing I did. I lowered the grill shell and the radiator on it because where I did that like a, a little mini channel right in here on the bottom and let it drop over the edge of the frame <clears throat> I think it's about a three quarters of an inch but once it runs out to the front it, it's even more so I went there and lowered the mounts on my radiator not lowered them but raised the mounts on the radiator and uh, lowered my grill shell. Got it now where it looks more in proportion. But y'all can let me know what you think. But like I say, I think it I think it's gonna look pretty good. If I can figure out what color I want to paint it, I'm on the fence on that. To me it's hard to beat a black hot rod myself, but I don't know if I want to go black or go like an old school blue, you know, like what I, I think they used to call it like a Washington blue or something that come on the Model A's or either a, a dark gray or something, just an old looking color. I don't want no metallics or none of that, that stuff, but, but anyway, guys, that was just a little walk around on it and like I said, I hadn't done a whole lot, just just the top wood and that and lower deck grill and stuff. But I don't. I, I'm kind of to a point where it's hard to video, but y'all don't give up on me because I'm I'm going to do my best to get you some videos to, to see something on it. Uh, but it's coming around, and if everything works out, I'd love to have this thing where it's painted before it gets hot weather in the summer where I can start assembling the car and get everything straightened out on it and drivable. But um, anyway, guys, that, that's really all I've got. Um, wish I had more for y'all, but I don't, not on this one. But um, hey, if you're watching my videos, hit the subscribe button. Uh, don't cost you nothing. Might as well hit it if you keep coming back watching or if it's your first time and you like it hit it and all you guys that have subscribed and keep coming back i really appreciate it and um we're, we're gonna get back on it hard for long i hope but um all right guys we'll check you on the next one later